with that, why don't eat in a row, like in the evening and stuff? And then you will start selling them why you are not allowed to eat this and that. They go like, I'm always doing like that, so you see no harm in me. You know? <laughs> and it's like, okay, as you wish. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like all the generation people, they are so hard to persuade and so hard to explain them some things, you know, because they they think they're the smartest ones. Yeah, that's true. You know, my mom, my mom, when she first time saw me uh, doing the protein shake, I don't know what she thought, but she she was like, "Why are you why are you taking what what are you doing, Roman? Do you understand what are you doing? Is this even legal? Is this powder legal?" I'm like, "Yo, mom, this is just a protein shake. Protein it translates as bilok in Russian. Yeah, so it's kind of just a supplement." No, I saw it on TV. It's really, it's really bad for your health. It's like, it's like she thought that as protein is some kind of steroid, mm -hmm. and she's like, look at you, you pump your arms. Well, that's not good for your health, and blah blah blah. I was like, oh, it's impossible to explain to her that it's okay. <laughs> so much silly. Yeah. Probably. Yeah, she's just, you know, my mom is just sitting there and watching these news mm -hmm. or these TV shows. You know, when they kind of all the time arg arguing about mm -hmm. something like uh, uh, let's talk mm -hmm. or with this other guy about about uh, politics and stuff red brand are you serious who is red brand oh stand on 14 why is that so why is he not serious it's, it's soft hand. oh it's a soft hand let's have a look maybe he had a nice decision Omer. well probably probably not yeah, 17 so we'll get honest, yeah. <clears throat> right. uh, but some time now Welcome Makar, join. Hello, Hussein. Hey, Hussein. Salam. I mean, yeah, like, TV makes a big brainwashing for sure. Like, people start believing in different silly facts and everything what they say there. Yeah. I mean, it's only made, like, to manipulate people. Exactly. Do you have a TV, by the way? Yeah, I have the box, but I never switch that on. Because, <laughs> like, these days you have a laptop and you can watch whatever you like just online. Exactly, that's what I do. I, I don't... Well, my mom has a TV. I don't have a TV. And I don't watch TV at all. Mm -hmm. I watch it only when she turns it on. But there is literally, if you kind of like switch the channels, mm -hmm. there are so many of them, but there is nothing, nothing you could watch. watch. Yeah, Everything, exactly. like old movies, which you saw like thousand times, news, news, and some stupid stuff. Mm -hmm. Like, really stupid stuff. Why? What's the I think the TV is dying actually, nowadays. Like, mm -hmm. when internet is on, I can find anything in, in YouTube or somewhere else. Exactly, like, this is like the age of the... Um mass media like internet and different social networks more yeah yeah i hope that one day the television will not <laughs> will not exist. be there anymore will not exist yeah but yeah but i think that uh th it might happen actually i think but in the end internet might just kind of transform it to that t TV format. I hope it's not going to happen because while I have internet, because it gives it gives me that freedom mm. out of all the you know um, borders. For example, they cannot say many things. Mm -hmm. I like that. For example, some bloggers they can use some rude words as well. They can, they have this freedom. You know, I like that. It's cool. Mm -hmm. It's nice. Yeah. You can f feel the life inside of them. Not <laughs> like not like plastic. You know, just reading the text. Yeah, exactly. In Zoom and welcome. Are you following any bloggers? Yeah. Actually, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm making an announcement right now. I'm a YouTube addict. Totally. I'm kind of like spending so much time on the YouTube, you cannot even uh, imagine. I don't know when did it start. Too many. Deal about. Oh, actually, yeah. I know when it started. It started when I started going to gym. I started to subscribe on fitness channels mm -hmm. to watch how to make exercises and everything like that. But now I watch so many stupid channels. So many, some of them that are okay, but some of them, <laughs> they're just, oh, YouTube is actually a big, big bin as well. Some of the channels are just so bad and you can, you kind of watch it, but you don't understand why are you doing this? Why? Mm -hmm. In one moment you just catch yourself. Why am I watching this for 40 minutes already? Why? <laughs> 
addiction probably. Oh yeah. These days addiction. And you know that many people actually making a lot of money out of it. Of course, yeah. From your attention. Do you watch some someone on YouTube? To be honest, no. I like got no time for that. I'm too busy with my Such own busy. stuff. Such busy. What kind of stuff? Uh, well, working out first of all. The second thing I'm reading a lot. Working a lot, yeah. of course, <laughs> and also I'm busy with building my own accessory line. So I'm going to make a sh um, shop in Etsy website All right. to sell handmade stuff. Uh, like accessories, like uh, different bands. Uh, yeah, different bracelets, a earrings, and headbands. All right, that's cool. So still, you are a designer, right? Yeah. You're still sort doing of, your sort, sort of. of. You know, a couple of days ago, I was actually uh, reading about. Uh, I was. Uh, I was online in Instagram mm -hmm. and I'm subscribed for a couple of groups with uh, like different like wares, you know. Mm -hmm. And there was this group and it told that this one company is uh, giving away bracelets mm -hmm. from stones. And I was like, oh, okay, what do you need to do? But uh, the thing is that you only you had to do is uh, uh, pay for the shipment. Mm -hmm. So it was like 10 bucks or something. And I was like, $10. Actually, it's nothing but. Do I really need Do that? Do I need that, right? Yeah. So I was like, yo, I could actually make it by myself. And <laughs> I found on eBay, like these stones, they're super cheap, you know, like stones of uh, volcano stones, they're called, mm -hmm. or uh, diamond stones, they're called, like different, different type of like stones. They look cool. Yeah, they look cool. Mm -hmm. And I could make them by myself if I, if I would want. Mm -hmm. or, or for example, I googled on AliExpress, you could actually get the same thing for a dollar. Yeah, but you have to wait like half a year. Well, but oh, yeah. you know, there are some people who are still not aware of those websites like AliExpress. Uh, simply they got no idea where to buy those stones. So that's why they will always catch up on this kind of uh, offer. Oh yeah, or for example, some people which don't really care about the amount of money they spent. Yeah. They just see a beautiful thing and they be like, okay, I'm buying it. Mm -hmm. Cool, cool. But what are you working usually night shifts, right? Yeah. What time do you wake up? Well, usually 4 p.m. and stuff 4 like that. Yeah. Try to work up at least three, four times a week. 4 p.m. Wait a second, but what the time do you go sleep? Uh, usually nine o'clock, half nine. Oh, so you come home, you do something, and then you well, go. Well, not really do because it takes me a lot of time to come back home actually. Where do you live? Um, it's like 25 kilometers from. Okay then. Okay. From capital. Mm. All right. Well, yeah. 10, 11, 12. Well, yeah, like eight, approximately eight seven, hours. Seven, seven hours. Yeah. Four o'clock. And then you have to start 11, so, well, yeah, you have some time, you have some mm -hmm. time. So basically, when you wake up and kind of start doing your things, I finish my shift. Yeah. It's just only a, I work in the morning and in the night. Mm -hmm. hmm. Well, yeah, and you get paid more. Oh, I didn't say that. Did I? <laughs> no, I did not. Zlo <laughs> electric, hello, nice. Zlo electric, why are you wow. so zlo? Because low electric is not good, because you mean... Probably you wor working too much, right? Yeah, you have and to have some breaks. Last time you had vacation was two years ago, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> You're be, so I mean. Would, I would be evil as well, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for you. Okay. Well, uh, I can check here. Yeah. What kind of books do you read? You say that you'll read a lot. I usually like a blog about business and some motivational stuff. Oh, like journals, right? Yeah, well, mm -hmm. yeah. Well, I'm doing some stuff like uh, when I'm obviously building my uh, my works. I'm usually putting on the audio book, and so I'm listening to that and working at the same time. Even uh, to bunnies. I have. You do have this thing with the uh, video books, audio books. Seventeen for the dealer. Congrats to the winners. Nice job. A lot of bad behinders. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. For example, I have this thing that well, if I listen to audiobook, problem is that I forget everything really fast. Everything what I've heard. Mm. I don't know how when I read, not listen, I kind of have everything in my memory well, more. To be honest, like I'm just because I'm con not really concentrating too much. I'm just doing like, uh, let's say, out of work. So I know exactly what I'm doing. At the same time, I can concentrate all my attention to to the words, to yeah. what they say. 
and sometimes it's like that when I'm reading the book, sometimes I'm flying away somewhere far away and I don't remember anything, so I have to reread that. Yeah. Same happens with the audio books, but I mean, I still remember some of the information because, like, my attention is not so much focused on actual thinking, but I'm doing at this, uh, two things at the same time. All right. Of course, you just need to g <clears throat> give yourself some breaks. It's not like you're working like two hours in the world. Like, if you listen to and you actually have a feeling that obviously you're losing all your attention, you need to give yourself a break. Oh yeah, makes sense. Mm -hmm. What's up, Penka? What's going on? Matvey, Matveyushka! Hello, hello, how wow. are you? Привет! Hello. 21, perfect. Having Sahin car with us as well and you guessed better. Hey, Sahin. Seni seviyorum, bol şans, and all that stuff. Play it back. Nine stars by Furkan Say. Yay! You're the hottest one so far. Nine so stars. Hard. Eight for Osista Sigwan. Cool, cool. And uh, uh, did you hey hearty? Where are you from? Did you say hey, buddy? Yes, I'm from Latvia, and I did say hey. And where are you from? Haha, ha, lol, I am a FIFA gamer. Wow, man, that's funny, first of all. <laughs> it's nice that you told it. And secondly, you're a FIFA gamer, huh? Okay, what's your team, mate? What kind of team do you like? Are you getting paid for that? Hey, I Art, why you never say hello to me? I mean, like, are you, I don't know. Who you are? Why you never talk to me? Like you just like, oh hot all the time. And like yo Roman, what's up? That's what's up, uh, boy. Boom, here we go. High five. Talk to me properly, lady. Galatasaray. Oh, of course, Galatasaray. Not Fenerbahce. Too many dealers. You got the winners. We got a double down. Special congrats. Mm -hmm. I'm talking properly with everyone. It's not like everyone is responding to me. Sixteen sixty-two join. Art, you know, jealousy, that's actually fine, it's natural, it's natural, mate. But sometimes it's not natural at all, at all. it means that you're having some complexes. Yeah, man, Art, what? I mean, I always say hello to you, because I thought that we were friends, man. <laughs> I thought that there's some kind of special connection between us, man, but it seems like it's just, I was wrong. I was so wrong. Oh my god, hi, Igor. You got a blackjack? Yeah, yes, for you, Karen. I am from... Porn 